Hi. So the challenge was to uh, write a poem about what you hope for in 2022. And hope is not, you know, one of my big uh, poetic uh, uh, themes. So I kind of wrote about how people play on your hopes and desires and, you know, sometimes take advantage of it. Uh, for their own gain and so forth or sometimes you, you know you, you it's 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 you, you you use hope as a you know as a crutch or um uh to uh, it's it can be fatalistic it can be nihilistic so um this is called dowsing desire now dowsing like uh using a dowsing rod d-o-w S-I-N-G, so kind of dowsing for people's desires and figuring what their hopes are and using them. Or, and then at the end, uh, you'll see that um, you have to understand that uh, it's a poem of 2022 because I speak about 100 years of uh, quanta, you know, uncertain quanta. Now, Heisenberg's uncertainty principle is like 95 years ago, but uh, five years before that, it, 1922 uh it was uh the, the quantization was actually discovered proven quantization was proven it was theorized in 20 in 1921 but in 1922 the experiment was run that that, that actually proved quanta now the problem is that this is these are actions that take place in the micro world but i really think that People, artists, <laughs> artists and philosophers, uh, you know, they they, they 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 accepted it at face value. You know, uh, the, the the things in, in the micro world uh, as if they are realities in the macro world. And we've been living for a hundred years under these, uh, to me, false assumptions. You know about what the macro world really, really is. You know, so. Dowsing desire. My sunny day is all behind me. Green screen weather models. Exquisite emotional erections. Palm like a nut for overconfident suckers salivating on shifty sidewalks. Dopamine deception. Like penny slot jingles covering negligible losses. Bagging biopsies. Precarious, precious plastic pouches, sealed with air kisses. Hunted in moonlight, apolitical crosshairs, bleeding heart, towing the cloudy boundary of hope. Hypnosis being self-hypnosis, except when God dangles earth on angel-spun silk string. A century of uncertain quanta, art, diamond-collared poodle, sniffing the didactic back end of dogma. So you could say it's about hope, but it's the opposite side of hope, maybe, or side of hope that, you know, maybe, maybe, uh, maybe, maybe it's worth thinking about. Uh, something that might, you know, if you just reading the word, or hearing the words, when I say a bleeding heart, uh, it, it's H A R T, which is obviously, uh, which is a deer, you know, a deer towing the cloudy boundary of hope so you know the deer hopes it don't get shot you know in, on, on a moonlit night you know don't we all and uh one other thing is from reality in this poem is uh, uh talking about the uh palming the nut you know it's and that's based on um a good friend of mine, a long time ago, I had to pull him away from a three card money game because he really thought he could see where the, the, you know the the card was that the dealer was, uh, was was palming, you know. But he, you know, they give you the first, the first guess. They put the right card down and make you think, oh, oh, my hand, my eye is quicker than their hand, you know. And a guy whispered in my ear, "This is on me. I'm probably, I don't know, forty something street in Manhattan, and and." Um, Guy walks up to me, whispers in my ear, "Get your friend out of there! You know, get your friend out of there! He, he can't win. It's a rigged game." So I'm pulling my friend by the arm because uh, he wants to throw another twenty dollar bill down, which is a lot of money, probably in 1980 or something like that, 80, 85, somewhere in between there. So these are this is what hope can do to you. Hope can you know lead you down a 
you know, a path you might not want to go down. Anyway, there you go.